Hi all, welcome to Pantech eLearning. If you like this video, kindly click on the like button and share the video to your friends. We'll be going for Euphoria account creation, adding Euphoria to Unity 3D, deploying an AR app. So how that AR app and uh, Euphoria will be integrated. So inside that, if we go for some technical parts means, here we'll be seeing for that uh, multiple sections. So that multiple parts means uh, the license key, target creation, and again image uh, towards our system. So that must be a targetable one. So that targetable is also most important. And we have to just uh, look for it now. So therefore, let us start with Euphoria account creation. So for that, it is most uh, important for the internet. So internet connection is important since we are accessing through OC cloud. So go for Euphoria developer. So here we have an section for the, so those who don't have account, they can go for the register, registration part. So many of them won't be having account, I hope so. Therefore they can directly go for the registration part. Then we have to log in with our password. Okay, so here it is not matching the password. So let me reset it for a while. Password has been resetted successfully. So many of them will be thinking without any connection with system, how does that has changed? Nothing. I have logged in through my mobile and uh, changed the password. So here, uh, previously, I have just uh, implemented with many kinds of sections. So there are many kinds of parts over here. Okay, so this is the uh, license manager as well as the target manager. Now, how to create a license manager? It is very simple over there. Just we have to click on that particular get development key and provide a title, provide a license name. And here I am providing test ARTR. So here we have 1000 per month of usages. Target is 1000. You can provide 1000 targets. But each and every time, whenever I am creating for each and every person's means. So this uh, provides a lot, a lot of sections, which makes me more easy uh, to show for everyone. Okay, then click on confirm. Now, from that particular, it has been created as ARTR. Click on that. Now, this will be the license key which we have to use to communicate between Unity or whatever the app you are going to generate with this Euphoria Cloud. Euphoria is just a cloud only, uh, which integrates for augmented reality. Now, the next thing is uh, go for the target manager. So, target manager has been obtained. So, to apply to this target manager, we need uh, some images as a database. Now, here I'm going to take this as my image just uh, will show will show you that product here i'm randomly taking the part so this will be that particular part which i'm going to store it as an image okay so now i'm taking that particular i have taken the photo just uh, sharing to the okay the photo has been sent now let us download that photo uh, now the issue is not all the images we will be able to upload it towards our uh, augmented reality part. There are some sections to be making over here. We'll show you what are that particular issues. So here now the image has been downloaded. Now I'm going to upload this as a direct target. Click on add database, create a database name. So this also I'm providing it as ARTR for device, cloud, anything you can provide. And uh, here I am providing it in the form of device. So create it and it is ready. Now get into that. It is completely empty. Click on add target. Select it as single image. Then browse the file. Go to the downloads. Take the image. Provide some width, width around for it. Providing dash uh, 80. This width size only will be known as the default units. Now I'm going to add the image. Not sure uh, whether it will be going out directly. Let us check once. Okay, so the same image only. Now I am adding it. So it must be less than 2 MB. And what is our file size? It is greater than 2 MB. So this is the main problem, the size rectification. If you guys are facing that problem means what should be done, open this, crop the image. 
this cropping uh, section will be uh, applicable only for some portions like some type of images only it will be applicable not for all the image let us try whether it is applicable or not else we will go for another method now it has been saved created with same width okay so this is not able to work under that so now again we are going to the same open it now open snipping tool save it save it in somewhere capture got it now it is ready go for browse the same size only i am going to provide click on it now the size has been completely reduced now the problem is the file size so this file size we have to convert it so it is less than that particular section only but some conversions is needed for that we can move for our online compiler can convert it to any image format either jpg to png or png to jpg png is also acceptable but here there are some gray scale uh, conversion problem since we have taken the screenshot so therefore now we are downloading it okay once again let us try successfully added and we have four star rating four star rating means definitely it is augmentable similarly the, uh, we can also obtain if you are providing any of the plain plain colors means uh, that comes under the uh, zero rating which is not augmentable a camera or uh, a ar app won't be able to get it to get any kind of sections so that particular section only here it can be said as non augmentable thing now uh, the same thing here we will be able to get this augmentable only with different features so this different different pattern features are only most important over here okay so here we can see augmentable and if you want to see that features means click on show features so here we are having multiple features up over that because of this particular feature only now it is able to go for recognition so this comes under the recognition augmented reality okay so therefore our complete part is ready with the cloud now let us get back to the unity open unity hub okay so here uh, let us create a new one for everything i am just providing artr it's not necessary that uh, it should be provided like that even if you provide it in different different name also it is applicable only So for our SDK, we have to accept this particular section, accept it, and now our complete environment is ready. So if you go for game object means, you can see that Euphoria engine. So from that, these are all that particular sections which we will be able to see up over that. Okay. So now from this, we are going to take the most important part, AR camera. And once when we are taking this AR camera, therefore this. main camera should be deleted there is no use of that here it won't be detecting until uh, you provide that license key over there because this comes under the euphoria part only let us run and see once and think to the play mode yeah so here that particular device it is being detected okay so everything is perfect now for augmented reality training we have to provide the required license keys up over there now along with this we have to add our target image also okay now we have to add one more function known as image target so before adding image target let us download the target part from our euphoria cloud and download all the database for unity editor download downloading is ready just give a single click on it so this xml file and dat file uh, captured the scale of jpg everything will be imported into the unity now if we add our image target means we will be able to recover that particular target image so image target is ready 
So inside this AR camera, we can provide our configuration with the license key. So license key collection is done from license manager, ARTR. Click on this, it will be copied automatically and paste it. So webcam, USB 2.0 webcam, everything is there, perfect. Now get into it. So inside this uh, image target will be image from database we can take. But whatever we have created, it is for uh, database only from ARTR. That will be the name. And this will be the our target image. If you like this video, kindly click on the like button and share the video to your friends. Don't forget to subscribe our channel.